box that has your solar disk in it. You have your main box that has your main umbrella in it. And what I recommend is you just take it, lay it on your table where you're going to use it, take it out of the boxes, and I'm going to show you how to put it together after you get it out of the boxes. The umbrella comes out and there's a male and female wire. Uh, one side has got a little clip on it. You can push it and they clip in. But it's made that way so you can't hook them up wrong on your disc. There's a male and a female and it's the same thing on your disc, a male and a female. take the solar panel out of the uh, box there's threads right here and these threads match these threads you just line it up and spin it on it's that simple you just spin it on there okay now it's ready your, your batteries come pre-charged, so when you take it out of the box, as soon as it gets dark, it'll light up. Or if you want to cover it up with a, cover up this solar panel with a black cloth or something, you can try it. But all of our umbrellas, we try them before we ship them out the door. Every umbrella is ready to, so you don't have to worry about a charge. You can just connect your male and female. Anyway, the wires are black coated, so you can't mix it up. And there's a male and female, so you can't. And you connect, you just push it in, push it in tight. And then push in the two watts of white wires, line them up, and push them in tight. It's ready. The umbrella's ready. You got the two black wires connected, male and female, and you got the two white wires connected. So it's real simple. And then you just put your bottom pole on your table and secure it to a base. So the wind can't blow it over. There's a tie down if you want to tie your umbrella down. This fabric's guaranteed for five to seven years. It won't fade, mildew, or dry rot. You put a tie on it so if you want to tie the umbrella down on windy days, you don't have to take it in. But there's an on and off switch here. The switch has to be left on auto all the time so it can charge. If you turn it off, it won't charge. You'll turn off your lights. But I recommend you leave it on all the time so it's charging. Your lights will automatically come on at darkness and automatically go off in five hours. And if they, after five hours, if you need them on some more, they're off. You hit the switch, turn it to off, then turn it, give it about five seconds, then turn it back on. You give it 20 seconds, your lights will come back on automatically. It, and on one charge, it'll run 82 hours. So if you're in a restaurant and you're in between skyscrapers, you only get the sun two hours a day, you don't have to worry about it. This umbrella's gonna last. And if you're out in Seattle or somewhere where you get a lot of cloudy days, as long as you get one day every seven or eight days, or you get a couple hours every day where the sun's hitting your solar panel, your lights will run. Our umbrellas come pre-programmed to run five hours, but We've had a couple customers who wanted them to come on from dusk till dawn. So if you're ordering a custom-made umbrella and you want it set for special settings, if you let us know, we'll program it for your settings that you want. But if you don't specify, it'll come automatically with five-hour settings. But you can hit the button and it'll come back on for another five hours. Just remember to leave the switch on auto mode so it charges. Because if you have it on off mode, it turns off that you won't charge. If you have any questions, just make sure you get up with your salesman or your your uh, person you bought it from and we can help you.